weekly vlog number one. So, hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. I thought that I would start weekly vlogging. I'm in my bathroom right now, just randomly, but I wanted to start weekly vlogging and basically all that's gonna be is I'm just gonna film a few clips every single day of my day so that you get a grasp of the kind of things that I do in a week. And I've wanted to weekly vlog for a while now, A, because I just want to film little bits every day just to kind of so that I can look back myself on these videos because I like to watch back my own vlogs because it's like you know it's like watching back a family holiday or something like that um so for that reason and also because I enjoy watching weekly vlogs so I thought you know what I'm gonna start filming them so every Monday there will be a new weekly vlog at like 5 or 6 p.m not sure um exactly the timings um but it will be on a Monday anyway and then there will be like a sit down kind of like not necessarily a sit down video but like a different video on Thursday at about 5 or 6 p.m. so that's my schedule I've done my makeup today and um, yeah it is quite bold and I'm not actually leaving the house at all and I just like to do my makeup I just like to try different colors and different things and different lipsticks because I find it fun so um, yeah not even leaving the house and this is how I look thought I would do a little catch up also this um, weekly vlog is probably gonna be quite long not every week will be this long I think it's because I've you know just done that little haul that's gonna take up quite a lot of minutes but yeah some days will be only a few minutes some days might be longer and um, but today is gonna be the longest day because I've got to catch you up on a few things so in two weeks time i start a new job i am going to be working for like this kind of like farming company it's not farming but it's like seeds and like harvesting things i'll explain more when i actually start the job because then i'll know sort of what i'm doing and um, my brother and my cousin is also working there as well which is going to be fun so there's all three of us there and um yeah i'm excited to start working i'm going to be working like eight till five most days and then over time sometimes will be like eight till eight p.m and um yeah so hopefully i enjoy that so i thought i would just say that so i won't have like a hell of a lot of a lot to film when i'm working because i'm literally gonna be working every day but i'll still have a bits to film you know for the weekly vlog um in the evenings of those days and also on the weekends i'll film a lot so i'm still gonna be doing the weekly vlogs and thought i would just mention that um anything else to update i swear i had like loads oh yeah i know what i was gonna say uni i get my uni results very soon i will show you in a weekly vlog what my results are but yeah i get them to a week or two not really sure i'm not really expecting great things if i'm honest a couple of my exams i personally think went really well one of them i know went so 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 badly and um yeah every time i tell that to someone they're like oh yeah but i'm sure you've done fine you know you probably just think you've done bad i physically counted the maximum marks i could get based on what i answered and it was less than a pass so i know i failed it but how badly have i failed it that is the question um so hopefully my other exams were like bring that up a little bit um but yeah so that's kind of like my little update not as long as i thought i thought i'd be updating for a little while yeah um getting pizza soon i have just stuck some nails on they're just fake um fake these fake pink nails i actually cut them down because they're actually really long they're literally double actually more than double the length of this so yeah i just um popped them on i haven't done my nails in ages so i just thought i would and uh yeah very quick sticking them on i haven't done my nails in ages like i've literally had them like um just nothing on them for like weeks and weeks and weeks and i think every so often i like to just put some fake ones on don't think i'd ever go and get them done because it's a lot of money and also you know i like to have the freedom to just take these off whenever i want and then put them back on i wore these exact these exact ones um about a month ago and i've t i just took them off kept them on the side and now i put them back on again so i like to have that freedom um so yeah i've done that um yeah uh i had on my plan to hoover up today and to go outside um in the garden area it's not very much of a garden it's just a pavement area um just to kind of brush the tiles that i'm currently doing just to kind of make them clean well i'm quite tired i don't really want to do that i don't really want to hoover hoovering is the biggest job of the week for me because it takes ages to hoover this carpet um it's just kind of an old carpet and it just takes ages to hoover it like how i do it anyway and i just can't be bothered to do it so we're not going to do that today um so i thought i'd do my nails and then i was going to go on my phone i was like oh i'll just sit on my phone for a bit because i've ordered 
food from this takeaway and um i've actually i'll actually i'll show you what i've ordered when it arrives um but yeah it's it's on its way and i thought whilst i'm waiting i'll just go on my phone but then i remembered this week i'm having a week of social media at the beginning of the year i booked in booked in um i booked in if you know what i mean not booked in but i told myself um and actually planned in my planner um that every three months i would have one week off social media so if somebody messages me i will just check my messenger check my um instagram and check my snapchat like once a day just to make sure that no one has actually messaged me um because i will reply to messages that's completely different i just don't want to be scrolling on anything the only social media kind of thing that i will use is youtube I will be watching YouTube videos um, because I just think more of that as, t as a TV kind of thing. I just don't want to be aimlessly scrolling. So yeah, I'm no social media, no TikTok, no nothing. Um, so yeah, um, it's nice to have a week like that. Also, no posting. So I won't be posting on my fresh face um, Instagram and Facebook or my normal Instagram. Won't be posting on YouTube either. So when you're seeing this, I've just had like a week of no social media which is the week that i'm weekly vlogging um but yeah so i don't know what i'm saying i'm just rumbling a little bit um but yeah as you can see my lipstick started to come off it's not doing too badly but it is just starting to come off um but yeah i thought i would just update you i'm just gonna have a chill afternoon um also oh my god right i filmed a favorites video it was a feelings favorites and fails video for june and I did not include Tarty coming back to YouTube in that. Like, how how did I forget? Um, I w when I seen that she was coming back to YouTube, Tarty, I was literally like, oh my god! Like, I seen the video. She was my favorite YouTuber. She like inspires me to do makeup. She just was like, I used to just get so excited to watch her videos, and I've literally watched the same video over and over and over again. Um, because I just like to and yeah I didn't even include that in my favourites and that was the biggest favourites so yeah how annoying um, but I think I'm going to switch my favourites videos around now I think instead of like doing a feelings favourites and fails um, in, in a video I'm just going to do my favourites because I just kind of like the layout um, so yeah anyway I'll stop chatting I got a vegetarian burger I got it with barbecue sauce and salad and then some cheesy chips that probably won't eat all of these so I'll have like the other half tomorrow that's my takeaway right I've had my food oh my god my lipstick this is lipstick I must have gone like that good job I am not going anywhere um anyway I'm gonna edit this video that I filmed so far so just today um I think I'm just gonna edit each day on the actual day just to make it easier because I didn't know whether to edit all in one go had my takeaway food and I'm now going to sit down, edit this and chill for the rest of the evening. I'm going to watch Tati's video when she posts it at 6pm. And and then I'm going to watch Love Island at 9 and then go to sleep because I'm really tired. Um, so yeah, thanks for watching day one. I'll see you tomorrow for Tuesday. Don't know why I put two fingers up, maybe because it's the second day. Um, but today's Tuesday and I am seeing my friends today, Emily and Steph. I haven't seen Emily in a very long time, like months and months and months. I can't even remember the last time I saw her. But we're gonna go to a vegan cafe. So I'll try and film a little bit. If not, then I will just include pictures of like what I ate and everything like that for my phone because I'm not gonna get my camera out in a cafe if people are staring at me because it's awkward so just gonna throw that out there but yeah we're gonna give that a go i'm not vegan but i have been eating mostly vegetarian foods apart from the odd occasion and um i do want to kind of try like more vegan things for example instead of milk i've been drinking this soya unsweetened milk and I've tried almond milk don't really like that if I'm honest I really like um the soya milk and then next I'm gonna try oat milk because apparently oat milk is much better for the environment than soya milk but yeah I'll give the oat milk a go next time 
so far liking that so it'll be interesting to see um like what i think of it and everything i'm sure i'll absolutely love the food because i really do enjoy vegan food i think for me the only thing that i would find quite difficult to substitute is probably eggs and that's probably the only thing um is eggs and i could just get rid of them out of my diet it's not that much of an issue but i'm not saying i'm going vegan but i'm just saying like in the future that might be a possibility but anyway you will see them very shortly i've got ready um i'm just wearing this jacket my little walkers crisps um little um oh what you call it necklace and yeah that's my favorite flavor if you was wondering and um yeah i'm just kind of waiting till i think emily's gonna pick me up and then we'll head off right we're on our way to the cafe I'm here with emily and Hello. steph I don't think you've seen Emily in over like two years or oh something. God. It's since like prom or something. Oh my god, yeah, because I did the oh. reacting to prom video and yeah, exactly. and Emily yeah. and Steph was in that. But yeah, hopefully the vegan cafe will be good. I'll try and film it. If it's too awkward, I'll take a picture. But yeah, we're on our travels. Emily picked me and Steph up. Thanks, yeah, Emily. Great <laughs> Yeah. Oh so uh, <laughs> we'll see you when we're in there. Hopefully. <laughs> right i'm back um i couldn't film anything in there because it was way too quiet in there um lost a nail it's in my handbag i just need to stick it back on it was really quiet so i wasn't gonna video because it would just be like so awkward and plus they'd be like what the heck is that girl filming like yeah anyway but it's actually a really nice place he said he likes my necklace which is quite funny because this is prawn cocktail crisps and it's a completely vegan plant-based cafe but yeah, he likes my necklace. Um, anyway, so yeah, um, thought I'd just tell you what I had and then I can insert pictures over the top. It was actually quite a nice, cute little cafe. Um, but obviously the whole thing was like vegan, plant-based and it, there wasn't that many seats in there. So if the place was busy, you probably wouldn't get a seat, but it wasn't too bad. Oh, sorry, I thought I had the food in my face. It's just a spot, sad times. Um, but, Actually, I'm excited to use my face mask tonight because that'll cure that. Um, but yeah, I had an iced coffee. He said, what milk would you like in it? I said, oat milk. Not tried oat milk before and it was very nice. Liked that. So yeah, I obviously, as I showed you earlier, I um, in my fridge have got soya milk, which I like. Don't like almond milk. So I was like, okay, I'm going to try oat milk. So yeah, really liked that. And I had a little shot of caramel in there. That was really nice. I then also had a chia batter. It was, what was it? Apple smoked cheese or something. Apple wood smoked cheese, obviously vegan, with roasted vegetables and avocado and something else. I'm not sure, but that was really nice. The only thing that I would say that they could do better would be to perhaps put like a little bit of salad on the side because it just looks a bit weird with it just like placed on the plate and it wouldn't cost them exactly like that much extra to just put a little bit of a side salad as in like just a few leaves, you know. And then uh, we decided to get some cake because they looked really nice. So I, me and Emily actually got a Biscoff piece of cake. They give you a really good piece of like a really good size and the cake was really, really nice. Like you wouldn't be able to tell that it was vegan. And um, yeah, that was three pounds for a slice and Steph got a Jaffa cake cake. Um, yeah, they had loads of different things. They had loads of choices um, in terms of the cakes, but yeah, it was a really nice little cafe. Emily drove me and Steph back home. So I'm now back home. And I'm seeing, tomorrow, I'm seeing my friends, I'm seeing Steph again, and I'm seeing Emma. So we've seen Steph and Emily today, and then tomorrow Steph and Emma. Whilst I'm here, I think I might just show you a few new pieces, a few like new bits and bobs that I picked up. So I picked up some cleaning bits and bobs. I got carpet cleaner from Wilco's. I got this Flora from... Wilco's as well it's the bouquet one that actually smells really nice um I like that one a lot and then I also picked up this which is super handy for cleaning like sinks and things like that and I'm gonna use it in the shower this is the pink stuff miracle bath foam so yeah really love that I picked up this from Lidl which is just a face wash pink grapefruit one I've actually got the um pink grapefruit face scrub which is in there they look very similar 
stocked up on a few shampoos and bits and bobs. I recently got this, which is a vitamin C um, serum. I got this from B&M. I also recently picked up this e.l.f. Um, eyebrow pencil. I think it's a little bit too dark for me. It's in the shade dark brown, but it's pretty decent. It's got a spoolie on one end and then the actual um, kind of pencil thing on the other. This is the Elegant Touch Brush on Nail Glue. This is the best nail glue ever. Um, most of the time my nails do stay on unless I do whack them on something quite hard, which I did today in the cafe. I picked up this from Lidl. It's just an anti-aging um, sun cream, SPF 30. Um, ran out of my body shop one. And then I was gonna go and make myself a moisturizer from like my own skincare products. Um, I make my own skincare products and obviously sell them on eBay and Etsy. Gonna go and make myself another gel moisturizer. Realized that my aloe vera had run out, my aloe vera gel. Obviously I buy things in bulk because it's cheaper. So I just don't have the money right now to just kind of buy um, that at this minute. I'm prioritizing other things. Um, so, I'll have to wait a little bit for that one. I thought in the meantime I could pick up a little moisturizer from Amazon, just a three pound one. This is the Revitalab um, day and night face cream. There's loads of words written on it and it says it's got hyaluronic acid and retinol in it. So yeah, retinol's meant to be anti-aging, so probably not my kind of age range, but hyaluronic acid is very hydrating. It's actually quite an interesting product. I have actually been using this and basically it says it's hygienic because you press the thing and some stuff comes out here instead of like you know dipping your hand into a pot which is fair enough but this does get quite messy and i thought to myself well, why don't they just use a squeezy tube because you can't get like more hygienic than a squeezy tube um but yeah it is nice um but i'm kind of missing my gel moisturizer and also i've broken out i've got spots since using this so i don't know if it's this or whether my skin's not used to it because my skin was really good um like literally no spots whatsoever and then now i've started getting spots so hopefully it isn't this um but we'll see so yeah there's a few things that i picked up over the past kind of like couple of weeks and um yeah i'll see you later I've just used the peeling solution from The Ordinary and to kind of like exfoliate my skin and I've just popped on my charcoal clay face mask that I make and sell on my eBay and Etsy. Link in the description if you're interested. Um, I just popped it on. I have a few spots so I popped it in my kind of T-zone area and like around my chin and I've also popped it on specific spots. So yeah, very much needed this face mask right now because for some reason my skin has some spots. I don't know why, um, it could be because of that new moisturiser that I'm using, but I don't know, so I will let you know on that. But yeah, I thought I would just um, say goodbye for today. I think I filmed enough for today. So um, see you tomorrow, goodbye. It's still Tuesday night, and I thought I'd show you my bedroom. Made myself a little cup of tea, and I'm gonna watch something on Netflix. I think I'm gonna watch Parks and Recreation and got my little lamp thing on and yeah i'm gonna watch a parks and recreation and then i'm gonna head to sleep my favorite clip of you mate is you trying to film your mcdonald's <laughs> <laughs> on the holiday because <laughs> i'm just over talking all the time and you're just like i don't like lettuce don't you see the point <laughs> in a mcdonald's in a mcdonald's yeah, yeah. So, uh, it's bad anyway so no point yeah what's the point Hello. We're on a picnic. Hello. Emma's here. Steph, as Hello. you saw yesterday. Again. Yeah, she won't leave me alone. No. <laughs> <laughs> you can see yourselves. Yeah, we've come for a picnic in the castle, Lincoln Castle. Mm -hmm. And um, I've had some couscous, got my lentil curls. And we're just chilling. The weather's actually quite nice.
it's the evening now. I haven't filmed anything since earlier on. All that you would have seen of what I filmed today was me at the picnic with Emma and Steph. Obviously, as you can see, I've got my makeup on. Can you see the spots I've got? Like, usually my skin is how my skin looks without these spots. And, um, yeah. I don't really care. I'm not complaining. Um, they don't bother me, but yeah that's weird but anyway um yeah i didn't really feel much today i'm just gonna sit down watch Gemma louise on youtube with a cup of tea and then i'm gonna sit and watch love island and then i don't know i feel like i want to do a workout because i haven't done a workout today so i might do a workout even though it will be like past 10 p.m but i had a little nap earlier so i've got energy from somewhere i've got loads of energy but yeah sorry i don't feel much today but we're in a weekly vlog so it doesn't matter if i don't feel much today because i filmed loads on monday Good morning. It is now Thursday. I'm wearing the same jacket that I've worn for the past two days. I'm wearing different clothes underneath, but just the same jacket. I don't know why, I just really like this jacket. It's cosy and comfortable. Um, not really got anything much planned for today. I think later on, we might go into Lidl. I've got a few things that I need to get, but not really that much. I'm gonna have to get some oat milk and um, probably some other things, but I'm gonna go outside into the like garden area and i've been like sweeping down here so what i do is i basically um like sweep that area because usually those tiles are really really brown so i've just been cleaning them obviously i've got no makeup on at the minute because i'm going to do a workout soon and then after i've done my workout i will then put my makeup on all i've done this morning is got up had a coffee had um, some breakfast and that was pretty much it and um, yeah, so I'm now gonna go um, do some stuff outside and pop some stones back that I've cleaned. And that's pretty much everything. Probably won't be filming very much for the rest of this week. It was just a lot filmed on Monday and Tuesday. I actually had 16 minutes of footage on Monday and I had to cut it down by half because I was like, I can't have one day taking up 15 minutes of the video. Royal Mail has um, just turned up when they have got a parcel for me so hopefully they will be able to get that to me um, but basically down here is where all the stones um, usually are like these ones here as you can see they're quite dirty there's loads of leaves and stuff in them whereas over here um, there isn't so I'm going to put a sheet down and then I'm going to put the stones that I've cleaned back on all of the stones are in this bag all of the stones are in these bags getting cleaned i've got all of those still left to do though those stones but yeah i'm just waiting for royal mail to give me my um parcel which i believe is my business cards for my skincare business i think i've got something on the camera this is what it now looks like after i've finished so basically this is a before where it's like got loads of stuff all over it and then now they're just nice and clean so i'm going to do that with the others as well I also got my parcel. Give it a little open. If I can. No, oh, they've not packaged this very well. I just opened it like that. That's terrible. But at least all my cards are here. So I've got all of my business cards now. I just wanted to get some. Um, so they're all in here. I've got 250, and this is what they look like. Why is it not focusing? Oh, there we go. Right, so yeah, these are my little cards. They've got like a marble effect kind of background. It's got the little QR code so that you can like shop my products from scanning that on your phone. So it's Fresh Face by Georgie Carr. It's got my Instagram and my Facebook on there. And then it just says homemade skincare products, which is exactly what it is. And then just my little logo picture. And then that's my little, I don't know what you'd call that little guy, but he's just, some of it that I put on, some of my labels, and just to do with my skincare business, I have a tattoo of the hippo. So yeah, there's my little card. So these will come with every single order. You'll get one with every order, and I might like pop a few around a few places. Um, but yeah, I'm super happy with them. So I'm just gonna shove them back in here. Baby, your legs on the floor. I just smashed something, and the bits on Stanley's cage. I, it's like a little cactus ornament and it fell off the side of the um, of the windowsill I'll show you and baby a leg fell off as well even though thank heavens he's just made out of wool so he's safe um, but yeah I'm trying not to stand on any bits there's some of it and there's the rest of it he's not doing too good 
think I'm gonna have to throw that out. Oh my god. Look how bad that looks. Actually, that kind of looks cool. I like that. I might keep it like that. Anyway, yeah, the windowsill knocked it off. So I need to go and get up all of the bits and bobs. Done my makeup. I just went for something simple. I feel like my eyebrows look really dark compared to the rest of my makeup because I didn't put that much um, foundation or concealer on. As you can see, you can still see my spots and stuff. Um, just because, you know, I just fancied something lighter because um, I find that when I put like quite a lot of foundation and concealer on, it does make your face look a little bit cakey. And um, it's not like I'm going anywhere special. I'm only gonna go to Lidl. Um, but I do feel like my brows are quite dark, but that's just what we're doing um, but yeah I can't believe that I smashed that thing my dad's coming around soon um, just for a minute or two so yes um, I might remember to film him why not who knows um, yeah I did my workout had some protein um, shake there he is and um, yeah I think I might make myself some lunch might have some couscous there he is chilling I've just been to Lidl, I'm back now. I thought I'd show you what I got. I only got a few bits. I literally only spent like six pounds something. Um, I got some crumpets. There's my crumpets. I got some oat milk. Here's oat milk and then there's the soya milk. I don't know which one I prefer. I think I might prefer oat milk but then soya milk's got kind of like a creamy taste that I kind of like. I also got this which is dairy free butter thought I'd give that a go and then I picked up some more of these um fiber yum brownies from Lidl they're like Lidl's version of fiber one brownies I also got this high protein cranberry and almond um granola funnily enough I do also have the other flavors I've got honey and seed is it honey and seed yeah honey and seed and then low sugar and the low sugar granola has got the highest amount of calories out of all three of these which I find quite funny um, so instead of sugar, it's just more calories. I think that's everything I picked up. I'm just going to head outside and pop my sheets out because I've been um, washing my sheets today. So I need to dry them actually quite quickly because I'm going to be sleeping in a few hours. So that needs to be dry. Um, but yeah, I'm excited to try this later. I basically have smoothie bowls. Oh, I also got frozen fruit as well. Um, it's like mixed um, frozen berries and I'm gonna blend it up later. I love smoothie bowls. I have them in the evening, it's like a pudding. I blend up my smoothie bowl. I don't blend up the bowl. I blend up the fruit and mix it with a bit of frozen banana as well. And then I add on some granola. I haven't tried this one before, so I'm excited to try it. Um, and then I just add on a little bit of golden syrup. So I'll, I'll try and remember to show you my smoothie bowl later and what I mean when I make one. Um, but yeah, I really get excited for that in the evening and it's kind of healthy because there's loads of fruit in it. But yeah, that's my little shop. Right, it is now a new day. It is Friday. So I've got technically today, tomorrow and Sunday left of this vlog, like to add into the weekly vlog. And um, yeah, I haven't filmed anything today so far and it is currently like half past six. I'm gonna make my tea soon. I'm gonna have, I think, vegan sausage, like a, it's kind of like um, cor chopped up courgette mixed with pasta sauce and vegan sausage. I don't know what it is. I just created something new um yes i don't look the greatest right now um i literally haven't worn makeup all day and um fun fact when i wear makeup i get less spots because i don't touch my face as much when i don't wear makeup i'm always touching my face because i think oh i've got no makeup on oh all good um so yeah i get more spots because of the bacteria on my hands which is not good um so yeah, um, but yeah, I didn't wear makeup today and I've just been basically outside in the garden like scrubbing the floors. I've tidied up around the place and my dad came around as well. He just popped in for a few minutes because he was showing somebody um, around in the flat next to me because um, my dad, if you didn't already know, my dad's my landlord and also to the next door as well. Um, so he was just showing some people around and um, he popped in and I at that moment in time was making a cup of tea and it was with oat milk I tried using that oat milk and guys I need some assistance because <laughs> I heated the oat milk up because what I do when I make a coffee is I heat up the oat milk um 
with the coffee in it in the microwave and then I add water. I just always have done that when it comes to coffee. I just heat the milk up first. Well, the milk curdled and went all bitty and horrible, like very badly. I'll try and remember to insert a picture. Then I thought, you know what? Maybe it's just because I put it in the microwave. So I added the oat milk, like the cold oat milk. I added it into my cup of tea, boiling water and I'll insert a picture now of how that turned out. Not great. Um, so I switched back to soya and this is what it looks like with soya milk. So much better. So um, I don't know what's going on, whether it was just the oat milk I used, no idea. But I think I'm just gonna stick with soya milk because it's just so much easier. Um, and I'm happy with that. Um, but yeah, and then the last kind of hour, I've just been upstairs in my bedroom, just um, sorting out my clothes. Literally got rid of about 50 clothing items that I'm just gonna keep away in storage in my garage. I don't tend to buy clothes. I'm not a clothes buyer. I don't go shopping regularly. I probably buy one um, item of clothing per year maybe. Like I really don't buy much um, because I just don't really care about fashion if I'm honest, but I need to be a bit more bothered. I'm just gonna try and use the pieces that I've got in my wardrobe and wear them a bit more because I just tend to reach for the same kind of items and I want to actually wear what I've got. So I thought, you know, the less items I've got in my wardrobe at this moment in time, then the more likely I am to wear stuff because it's not overwhelming when I like open the wardrobe doors. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it all day. Didn't think I had much to film today, so I thought I'd just catch you up sat here. I'm um, chilling, but yeah, like I said, I'm um, gonna go make my food soon. And then I'm just gonna chill this evening, watch Love Island, and um, have another smoothie bowl, of course, um, that kind of thing. So there's not really much else to film today. There probably won't be much to film tomorrow, but, you know, this is the thing with the weekly vlogs, there won't always be loads to film, but I think for me, it's just, some days will be a lot more busy than others and I don't really wanna film that much for the end of this week because I've been editing this, up, this video up so far and it's already at like 26 minutes, which I don't want these videos to be painfully long. So um, yeah, uh, I don't think I'll be filming much else. So yeah, I will see you tomorrow, um, Saturday for the weekend, which for me, weekends are no different to weekdays at the minute. I am starting a new job, as I said at the beginning of this vlog, um, so, obviously the weekends for me when I start that job will be very nice because during the week I'll be working hard. I'm gonna put full effort in, don't you worry. Um, but yeah, at the minute the weekends are the same as weekdays. So yeah, don't have any plans for this weekend. Oh, my face looks shiny. Um, hello, welcome to Saturday. Uh, yes, my face is really shiny. It's because I did some facial cupping and uh, used some oil. But I thought I would just announce my mum's here. Oh, and yeah. my brother is here. Hang on, I'm introducing mum first and then Tommy, um, who's also here. Um, so yeah. Hello everyone. Hello. Hello. Dad's doing some viewings next door. He is, yeah, we're looking for a new tenant. So. Excellent. Excellent, yes. Tommy's going on a night out tonight. Yep. Cracking open the cold one with the boys. Indeed, and I'm winning. And the girl. Yeah, and Saskia. Oh. Rocket lollies. Rocket but them two, two waters, two rocket lollies. I had a rocket lolly earlier. I've got my water in a bottle. Oh, yeah, right. <laughs> I am indeed. Tommy, are you excited for starting work on Monday? No, actually. Are you actually? Yeah. What do you think we'll be doing, or you'll be doing? I start a week after, by the way, guys. Oh, yeah. Well, you'll be going in at management level, obviously. Oh, yeah. yeah probably some sort of um, barley harvesting, I would have thought. Oh, hopefully I'm doing something like that. Barvesting. Yep. yep. Brilliant. Brilliant. I'm not excited, but I need money, so. I am. There we go. I'm gassed. If it's um, fun, then yeah, sure. But we'll see, won't we? We will Make see. Right, it's the last day of the weekly vlog, number one. It's Sunday, mum's um, driving again, okay. and Tommy's in the front. He had a night out last night. Where did you go? Um, well, we started up the hill. Um, Prince of Wales, Lion Snake. And then we went down to trebles, although I wouldn't be that in because I had shorts on. Oh. Even though it's 30 degree heat, a pot in the south of the bouncer. Oh god. Anyway, and then we went to red five. Did they let you, so they didn't let any of you in? Or did the others go in and you just no, wait? No, they, 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 because I wasn't allowed in, they didn't go in either. Oh right, good, otherwise that would have been we were, terrible friends. Everywhere else is calm though. Oh, Don't calm. go to trebles if you're in shorts. Yeah. 
Yeah, Tommy wasn't allowed into one of the places that they were going to go in last night because he was wearing shorts, which I did explain to him before he went well, they out. They termed it sportswear. He was wearing sportswear. Yeah, they need to make they don't sure allow they shorts to be stopped. Today. So if no idiot is going to walk in there with a load of trousers, if we do, I think I'll be a bit concerned. <laughs> Give it quite. We're off to Lidl first and then to my mum's. I'm staying there for the night and dad's obviously. Um, no, it's my house, not his. <laughs> it's that. Um, but yeah, let's go. Right, we're here. I think the last clip was in the car. Me and mum are actually gonna film a video, I think, um, a baking video that's gonna be on my channel on Thursday. Yeah, we're doing some baking because I forgot to actually get a dessert for today and we've got people round. So. Yeah. Ah, needs must, but yeah, just yeah. for the right amount of eggs as well. Excellent. Fortunately. Excellent. Um, yeah, I've been outside chilling. My family's there. Chilling? Don't know it's if you can see. Degrees. Yeah, chilling in a different way. Everyone's sat over there. Apart from me, who's grafting. Yeah. Always grafting. Dad's been reminiscing about the time he worked at Tesco when he was younger. That's funny. About 35 years ago now. Yeah. Can, can we just take a moment with mine safe safe though? Um, guinea Pials. Oh, Guinea. 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 Right, we'll speak to you later. Hey, Tommy. What? Hey, Dylan. <laughs> just the same as what you do. It's a bit too warm for dinner. Oh, yeah. Me and Mum are baking. Oh, dear, I nearly tripped. Oh, really? Hi. Look at this watermelon. Did you get that Harry Styles song in your head? Which one? Oh, I actually listened to that earlier whilst I was in a workout. Not through choice, it's just in a playlist. Hello Dad. Dad's washing his hands, Whoa. he's doing a 101 on how to wash your hands. Yeah, look, that, look not wasting water. <laughs> oh yeah. There's no need, there's no need for it. <laughs> look at that yeah, dribble. But, yeah, but there's no need. It's not, what, you see, you put soap on your hands and the soap washes your hands and then the water is there to sort of work with it. Not, not throw it all over your hands and waste it. So why would you? Thanks for sharing. Yeah. We're gonna have a spot of lunch outside. Mum's made some pasta, got some watermelon. Them lot are inside watching something on TV. Me and Mum are outside. Oh, the Grand Prix. Got my pasta. Grand Prix from yesterday, we're getting it on catch up. The uh, qualifying or? Oh, boring, I'll show them. Watermelon. Hi. Tommy and Dylan are playing some kind of ball game and they want me to film them playing it. It's a massive, gigantic ball. <laughs> Careful, you don't hit anything. I think he's gonna welly at one. Oh, he caught it. Oh, hello. Oh, I can't because I got two things in my hands. Oh my god, mind the pond. To me. Wait, my go. <laughs> <laughs> he's doing, <laughs> he's doing keeping your peace with this gigantic ball. <laughs> uh, right, everyone started showing off now. Oh, maybe not. <laughs>
you on film. Mind people's glasses. <laughs> They're just playing, don't worry. <laughs> Last clip. Oh, yeah, where are you going? Over there? Yeah, we got told off because we keep hitting it on there. <laughs> I'm worried. <laughs> I feel like I'm gonna get bullied, I'm leaving. Yeah. We've come to a more spacious area of the garden. So what are we doing? Uh oh. <laughs> We're just having a quick game. Nobody knock this. Where can I put the camera where it won't get hurt? I could sit it on here. Can you see if it's the right place? Oh no, that's slanted. I'm in place! Hey! Oh, I've got D! your boy right i'm back in the house it is still sunday and we've just been outside we're still outside now oh, my makeup's dripping off um but i thought i would actually end the vlog here because to be honest with you there's not going to be that much more that i'm actually going to film and also i need to edit this video so i could film more to be honest but i don't want to because a this video is going to be extortionately long and b um i need to edit this video so 
thought I'd just end it here. If there's anything else I film, I'll just add it in after this clip. But thank you for watching weekly vlog number one. I know it's quite long. Next week will be a lot shorter. But thank you for watching. If you've made it this far, very good, very good. Um, and yeah, I'll see you next week for weekly vlog number two. And on Thursday, there's going to be a baking video with mum. So see you then. Thanks for watching. Bye.